Hi guys. Today I'm going to show you how to fix the CPM error CACPM 804E. This is a known issue. This happens due to certification expiration of CPM engines. You can find CyberArk article in the description in case you need to know more about the issue. Basically, the issue is CPM engine will stop processing tasks due to expiration of signatures. You can find the error in pm underscore error.log file as CACPM 804E error verifying CPM engine signature backslash bin backslash cyberarc.tpc.exe has expired. Also same for other plugin engines. The solution is to update the CPM plugin engines and certificate. First, we have to download the zip file containing the updated signed engines and related files from CyberArc Marketplace. You can find the link for the CyberArk Marketplace in the description. Let's download it. I have downloaded it and copied the files to the CPM server. Note that this new engine requires .NET Framework 4.8 as a prerequisite. So, let's check whether it is installed on my CPM server. You can use the registry setting which I mentioned on the description to check installed .NET Framework on your server. If the version is not installed on your server, make sure to install it before you update the engine files. For the required version is already installed on the server. So, no need to install it again. Now, on the CPM server, I'm going to unzip the downloaded files. I have to go to the CPM bin folder located at c colon backslash program files x86 backslash cyberarc backslash password manager backslash bin and replace the existing engines and files with the new files. Make sure to stop CPM service before that. Now, we have to update the certificate. To do that right-click the cyberarc.tpc.exe file and select Properties. Select the Digital Signatures tab, select the signature in the signature list, and then click Details. Then, in the Digital Signature Details window, click View Certificate. See, the certificate window has appeared. Now click on Install Certificate button to install the certificate on CPM server. Select Trusted People, click OK, and then click Next. Let's start the CPM service. Now, let's check pm underscore error dot log file to confirm whether the issue has been resolved. We can see, now CPM has start processing the tasks. Let's finally check on PVWA site to confirm functionality of CPM server. Here we can see CPM is functional. OK. That's it from this video. I'll see you with another video. Thanks for watching.